take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. For most airlines, the company policy states that piercings and tattoos cannot be visible when wearing the uniform. Meaning that you cannot have this kind of personal expression on your face, neck and ears, hands and wrists, lower arms and ankles. Let's help you make your mark. Disrespecting a crew member is a surefire way to be escorted off a plane. Another way passengers can get kicked off a plane is if they get physical with someone and in extreme cases, try to open the plane door mid-flight. Take our lead. Whether the flight attendant job is worth it is entirely up to you. It's one of those jobs with so many pros and cons, and you really have to look at each one of them and decide if this is for you. To me, it's more of a lifestyle than a job. Let's help you make your mark. Flight attendants have shared some of their most scary mid-air experiences. Think of the worst day you've had at work. Then throw some severe turbulence, an emergency landing, and a dead passenger into the mix. A flight attendant is an extremely stressful job with long hours and time away from family. Let's help you make your mark. It isn't uncommon or some international airlines to have specific weight requirements and be willing to remove flight attendants that go over this weight limit by so much as a pound. There's even a court case where a flight attendant sued after being grounded for coming in one pound over the weight limit. Make your mark, take our lead. Fortunately, most successful candidates pass the training period and exams successfully and start working for the airline immediately. But the training is hard. As in, really hard. Training can last anywhere from 4 to 8 weeks, 11 hours a day with just one day rest a week. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.